Hey everyone, it's Yasmin, and today I'm sure you guys a video on three ways how to fade or kind of remove your stretch marks, make them less noticeable, and yeah, let's get started. Okay, so just a disclaimer, this isn't like relevant to everyone, not everyone has stretch marks. Um, I know I do just because I grow really quickly, and just from like growing my skin has developed stretch marks, so this is going to be just like really, like really easy three ways to like kind of fade them and they're all home remedies so you can just do them at home make them at home they're really really simple so yeah let's get started with the first one okay so the first one that probably a lot of people know about is coconut oil that's what it looks like and you can get it anywhere you can get out like um what is it called just like health stores like farmers market or like uh, what is it called? Like Trader Joe's or something if you live in like California area or whatever. There's a lot of those there. So, um, this is just regular coconut oil and coconut oil is really, really good for a lot of things. It's good for your hair. It's good for your body just because it's a really good like moisturizer. And it's also good for like fading your stretch marks. So like every night or something, just like put this on your body or just wherever you stretch marks and it will slowly start to fade them and make them less noticeable, especially the purple ones. Because if your stretch marks are purple, then those means, that means like the new ones. So that will, um, those will be easier to fade. And if they're white, then those are kind of the older ones we've had for a while. And you can still fade those, but it probably takes a little bit longer since they've already kind of been on your body. And yeah, so the first one is coconut oil, and this is pretty much anywhere you can get it anywhere. Um, this is the naturally refined oil, but the one, you don't want to get the one that's refined. I actually got this one by accident, but it works as good. You can get it at like Sally Beauty Supply, um, just anywhere. So that is the first one. So yeah. Okay, so the second one, I've only been using for like a couple days now. I used it like, on like, I think like, Wednesday or Thursday and I just use it today again. It is a coffee scrub and all this has in it is coffee, sugar, um, olive oil, coconut oil, and I think that's about it. And then, yeah, it's really good because you can lather all over your body or just like, okay, wet your body first or whatever you want to do. And then um, put this all over your body or on like your stretch marks. I put it all, all over my body and then leave it on for like five minutes. And there's like a good, not like a dupe, but like I got this idea because um, there's like the Frank um, scrub stuff you can get, which is from like Australia or whatever, but I watch a lot of videos on that and I see that people like run out of the bags of that body scrub like a lot quicker, so like I feel like it'd just be better if you made your own. So if you guys want me to do a video on how to make this, it's really, really simple and it makes your body feel really, really soft, especially in like winter months because the olive oil and the coconut oil moisturize your skin and also like help to remove your stretch marks. So that is the second way. Okay, so the third way is using egg whites. So what you do with this basically is you crack open the egg, of course, and then you just put the egg whites in a bowl, and then you want to, like, mix them around, like, froth them up with, like, a fork or something, and then you just put it anywhere you have stretch marks and let it dry until it kind of gets, like, kind of hard, like it's, like, a stiff feeling, and you're, if you put it on your face, your face kind of feels, like, stiff, and then you wash it off, and probably do this about, like, once or twice a week, and it will start to tighten up the skin where your stretch marks are, and so it will, like, reduce the look of them and also fade them. So, yeah, that is the third and final way. Okay, so hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was really short, but just some quick, easy tips how to fade your stretch marks. And, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment down below any, like, video suggestions you guys want, because I'm not really sure what to do videos on lately. I've been kind of, like, stuck. I'm not really sure. And also, please subscribe. That'd be lovely if you did. Subscribe wherever that button is. I don't know. Okay, so hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!